Rwanda envisions becoming a regional ICT hub and has committed to making the most out of technology to enhance service delivery. Most government services and financial transactions are done electronically via Irembo, a one-stop portal for e-government services that offer several services for citizens and businesses. Our mandate was to basically drive um, digitization of government services to, to the citizen. Uh, we launched the product that we had been working on. Um, we launched it in uh, July 5th, 2015 and we launched it under brand name Irembo. We chose the name Irembo because we thought um, for technology to be accepted and adopted well, it needed to, to be easy to, to relate to. And we thought we would find a name that's easy to understand for Rwandan that, uh, that conveys some meaning. So we chose Irembo as the gateway to government services. Irembo is really helpful in such a way that you get services you need without necessarily having to travel to government offices. For instance, I was in the process of applying for a laissez passer and I won't need to go to the revenue authority to pay for fees, but we do everything right here. The platform has helped a lot. People come to us seeking land services and we do everything for them at the same time. From declaration to payment, all services are offered all together without the client having to go here and there. Before, you know, citizens has to go to uh, districts, uh, sectors, uh, or local government offices to access e-government services. So now they are no longer going to uh, government, local government offices, rather they go uh, to our agents uh, we, who are um, all over Rwanda and then they can access um, a number of Irembo services but also other private services like uh, mobile cash services and mobile money services uh, and other value added services. The platform has not only helped in streamlining service delivery but also in job creation. Thousands of agents across the country are employed. RTN Network has uh, uh, 1,200 ICT access points or agents, and those agents facilitate uh, access, uh, facilitate citizens to access Irembo services. So this hel has helped them uh, to, 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 um, to access easily at really at reduced cost because they, have to, you, they don't have to travel. On the side of agents, it has become uh, an employment opportunity for agents because uh, we can estimate that at least we have 2,050, 2,500 people who are employed uh, throughout our, uh, our network. As businessmen, Irembo has increased the movement at our business. A lot of people are coming to us and we are never idle. It also makes other services we provide feasible. With growing internet penetration in the country, Irembo has had considerable success. However, everything has not been smooth sailing. Poor network is one of the critical challenges facing users. Nonetheless, the platform management promises to make improvements. There are times when the network is very poor. In addition to that, electricity is sometimes unavailable and that's quite challenging. When clients come to us, they expect a quick service but it sometimes takes long because of poor network, making our clients unhappy. So that's a critical challenge for both us and our clients. So one of the challenge was uh, internet connectivity because internet connectivity was not uh, everywhere in Rwanda. But again, RTN has uh, come up with a solution because now we are also providing internet. RTN has become an ISP. So we are providing affordable 
and uh, reliable internet, 4G internet to our agents. So that one has solved, even though it was a challenge, but now it's no longer a challenge. That's not the case because we have a downtime of um, 0 0.3%. So that means the system is up and running in 99.7% of the cases. So the, the, the platform not being up is really, has, has never been an issue. The platform is not perfect. We constantly work on improving both the technology, the processes, the usability. But again, the, I mean, saying uh, that someone can for example spend a whole day without being able to receive a government service because the platform is down that case has not yet happened